CSI 2140 Analyze Mode B can face up to 4 channels. My name is Johan van Pijmerhoek and in this video tutorial I will show you how to collect B can face measurements up to 4 channels simultaneously with the CSI 2140 Machinery Health Analyzer. What you're seeing now is a home screen of the CSI 2140 Machinery Health Analyzer. If you want to collect peak and face measurements, first of all go to the Analyze mode by pushing F7. This is a home screen of the Analyze application. Go now to Manual Analyze F1 and in Set Analyze mode F1 select peak and face from the drop down menu. F2 Set Order here you can specify which order that you want to measure peak and phase data. You can choose between 1, 2, 3 and so on, but most typically people will measure for sure the first order. F3 set bandwidth is default setting 0.1 RPM, that means he will measure a bandwidth of 10% around the imbalance value and that is a recommended setting. F4 set average for normal run out measurements or shutdown measurements this feature have to be disabled because you want to see peak and phase measurements from any moment in time and not an averaged value. Tag setup F7 here you can configure your tag for this tutorial we are using a traditional photo tag that means that the power has to be on and the trigger level is 2 volt. You can check immediately if your tag is well installed and configured by pushing F10 show RPM. As you see the speed information is coming in so the tag is correct configured. Delta time Default setting is zero, that means this feature is disabled. That means the system will collect data as quick as possible. If you enter here, for example, three seconds, he will only collect data every three seconds. Delta RPM default value is zero, that means that this feature will be disabled. If you enter here, for example, a value of five, data collection will be done every 5 RPM changes. You can also collect data only in an RPM range and here you can specify a minimum and a maximum RPM. Input setup F12, here you specify the kind of sensors that you want to use. First of all select input F1 here you specify how many channels you want to measure simultaneously in this example we will measure the four channels simultaneously. And F7 sensor setup. Here you specify what kind of sensors you are using. In this example we are using everywhere accelerometers with a standard sensitivity of 100 millivolt per engineering unit and power on. So sensor B is identical, C and D as well. So I will now start data collection and this is a screen that you see during data collection. You see the speed at this moment at the top and amplitude and phase measurements for every channel. When you stop the machine, of course the machine will go slowly down and you see the speed at any moment in time here and once again amplitude and phase for all the channels. So you can stop data collection by clicking F2 or F8 at any moment in time. And I will stop the machine when the speed I will stop the collection when the speed is around 600 rpm. So I will stop now. And now you can store the data in a job base structure or you can plot the data by clicking F9 and now you see for your four channels this is the speed and this is the amplitude for channel A, 
B, C, and D. So a few additional settings here to do is go to F6 switch plot type and there are more than four plots available however you can only present four plots simultaneously so here you can select different plots for example you want to see also the face from channel A and you want to disable the other channels all the data is measured and stored this is only what you want to review now and now you see amplitude face plot for channel A also called the boat plot switch plot or you can also include for example the Nyquist plot of channel A and then here on top you see the Nyquist plot I go back to switch plot and I change the plot format from stacked to quad and then the Nyquist plot is a little bit bigger you can also install a cursor on your Nyquist plot so this is only for channel A but when you go to switch plot type you can recall all the plots for all the different channels we are now at the end of this video tutorial CSI 2140 analyze mode peak and phase up to four channels my name is Johan van Pijnbroek please visit our website for other product video tutorials thank you for watching this tutorial